light for me is very important. Like I can't live in a place where there's no not good lights, you know. It's what makes me happy. It makes me feel free. And um, I'm here in California. I wake up every day and I'm saying to myself, "When is it gonna rain?" And it doesn't rain. I'm saying, "When is it gonna rain?" And it doesn't rain. When is it gonna rain? And it's a sunny day. So it's completely different from where I live, which is in Paris. A I think there's a lot of things that I got to say and do here. You know, it's like a like a new sort of storm that's about to arrive. A new vibe that's good. There's no, let's say, um, separation of the paintings or the drawings or the serigraph that I'm doing and who I am. There's no, you see this, all this looks like a big mess and bordel, you know, it's a big scribble scrabble of colors and explosions and, and that's the way the life that I'm living. My life is a sort of chaos and I'm trying to create um, harmony in that chaos and it's through that harmony that you see um, beauty. I'm working. Doesn't it look like I'm working? This is part of my work. This is part of my job description. My father, he used to be a decorator when he was young, when he was working, when he was alive. So he was, there was always color in the house, you know? And then later on, you know, me being Dominican Latino, um, you know, colors was what made me happy. So I would paint and, you know, some people would try to make things very dark with browns and greens and yellows. And I always liked the yellow, orange, bright colors because that's what attracted me. Before I started to paint on trains, trains like when the when it would um, come out the tunnel and it was completely painted, the flash of colors in your eyes what was attracted to me. So I tried to recreate that feeling with my art, a flash of colors. Yeah. yeah. So I'm a badass colors. My relationship with California, I guess, started with from. Um, Fabian Cassini in the gallery that's showing my work and def not only showing but defends my work. And for me, that means a lot. When I was a little kid, I used to pray to God, God, if you can just give me the opportunity to paint every day, I'll be the happiest man in the world. And you know, sometimes dreams come true because that's my life. <laughs>